on, huh? <laughs> Let's hurry up. I have to go. We got a hole. Thank God. Ooh, and it smells like acrylic, like my nail. Good morning, peeps. Guess what we're doing today? Okay, while well, I'm sitting here doing taxes, fun, huh? Let's see what the Freddy's doing. I'm putting an RO. I'm putting an RO system in. Don't move. You the can see the whole thing. Trust me. You, you just went like this down and like this the camera. Well, apparently I had fingerprints on the lens. So back to what Freddy is doing. The camera. I'm putting in an RO system, guys. Reverse osmosis and under the sink. What are you sitting on? I'm sitting on waddle, bottle, waddle, bottle. Waddle? <laughs> Give me another coffee, please. Give me another coffee. Multi-use products are amazing. All right? I found this out because I, like a smart one, decided to put coconut oil in my hair to help it yesterday um, because the water has been gross. I'm trying to do my tip of the day, thank you. My hair's been totally gross. Um, for the women out there, if you're in a campground and it has hard water or soft water or whatever kind of water, use distilled water and wash your hair. Take some lemon or I think it's lemon and Dawn dish soap and put that in your hair. Let it sit in there for like, I don't know, two or three minutes. Rinse your hair out with distilled water and use your own shampoo and conditioner. Actually, when you're rinsing that out, use your own shampoo and conditioner. And then, um, but when you're, when you're done, use coconut oil on the ends of your hair. I'm telling you what, I have, I have normally greasy hair, but since we started RVing, my hair's been horrible. Okay, Heather's cooking dinner and we got some business cards. They're not really business cards, they're hand me out cards. Thedepraise.com, travel with the wild and crazy to praise. RV tips and tricks, full-time RV lifestyle, RV product reviews, Jack. A little bit from me, most, a little bit from Heather. A little bit from Heather, and most of all, the cra most of all our crazy shenanigans through it all, go to praise.com. We know you'll find us funny. That way, people don't have to write it down, and you will have a card now. We got cards. We got 500, th 500 of these bad boys. Everybody asks us for our YouTube name, and we write it down. They're like, how do you spell that? So now, everybody has a card. Give me my hat. Try this again. Diamond into my new counter. Now, I'm gonna put the RO system handle I want right it here. No, I'm gonna go right here. I want it here. Okay, well, what's behind that? How do you know that's There's safe? There's nothing there. I just looked. So if I go down and I do have a one-time shot deal, and it breaks, my hand I, is I can't right do there. this. I can't draw. We cannot drill through our new counters. Will you just do it, damn it? This is insane. If that thing, if I do it in the wrong hole, I ruin the counter. How much does this cost? Just do it. It's like a stone deal. I don't know what it is. But I don't want it so close. Listen. I, don't, I want it like right here. So don't we have to measure from underneath the sink or something so it don't mess up? You can't do that. Yes, you can. How are you going to do that? You can't even see it. Wear a tape measure. Toes you crossed. You better be right. If this is wrong, Arms I'm going to be pissed. Crossed. <laughs> Eyes crossed. <laughs> Everything else that you can cross, cross. Bracket's right here, right? The bracket was right here, yeah. Whoa, way over there? Mm -hmm. Let me come over here a little, no? <sighs> well, I just go over here. Show them, show them. <laughs> if I go here. Listen, Pete. This is a diamond, this is a diamond bit. I gotta get it right. This is why we have so much drama because I say something, then he says something. Then I say something, then he says something else. <gasps> just walked on me. I didn't walk on him, Mr. Okay, we got a hole. Why isn't that fucking clean?
Well, guess what, peeps? My Freddy is a big rig driver. He is an amazing husband. He is an amazing computer technician, an amazing businessman, and guess what else? He's a plumber, too! I'm not a plumber. I hate doing his crap. Show me your plumber's crack. You got plumber's crack? No. Nope. Be smoking some crack in about two seconds. Craziness. Everything is out from underneath my sink. It's been laying around on the floor all day. But on a good note, this guy fits here. And I can swing him out of the way while I do dishes. So. We installed the RO system on the counter and we bleached it, whatever it said to do with eyedroppers. And we had to take this hose off and put it in there. Da, 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 da. So that filter does not need it, but I put an extra one in. It was only 14 bucks. Carbon filter. If we go to a park that has well water, we want to have that in there. I've got to go to that. And I can switch that every couple months. Okay, now Heather, Heather's impatient really as usual. I have to go to the bathroom. I've been waiting. Let's hurry up. I have to go. Fred, we got any leaks? No. No leaks? No, but I'm going to have a leak in my stomach in about five seconds. Okay, guys, I'm tired. I'm too tired to even put a shirt on. Good night. I still got to edit this video. Please, guys. <laughs> you know what to do. Lakers and sheriffs, you know you'll find us funny.